What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be making a video on how to get that perfect vocal preset for FL Studio and I'm just going to be showing you all the effects I have on there and I'll leave that preset for you in the description to download for free and uh, yeah so just go and download that and you can use it yourself and you can always just you know download it and change it so that it fits for you and yeah I'll just be showing it with this song right here which is uh, from Baby Rem called Lost Soul. Go stream that. And uh, yeah, like in the last video, I'll just quickly show you how it sounds without all the effects on it. And then I uh, will go through all the effects and I'll just show you how it sounds after that. This is how it sounds without. Yeah, I saw the AP made that time freeze. In the booth, talk about my life like this a diary. Smell like proud, I gotta make my father proud of me. Yeah, not sounding too good yet. But uh, yeah, so let's just quickly go through the effects. Um, Just starts off with the EQ right here. Just a basic EQ, just uh, cutting out the lows and some of that muddy stuff in the middle. And then over here, just, uh, you know, boosting a bit of those highs. Then I have a second EQ on there. And uh, this EQ right here is just more to go into like the details. So I use this one just to like cut out certain parts that I don't like. Like as you can see here in the middle, there's just these muddy parts. And then also again, cutting out the lows and then boosting the high parts a tiny bit again. But, uh, and so yeah, this is just pretty much there to like go into more detail. Uh, then the next thing I have on there is a compressor right here. I usually leave the ratio, type, release and attack all the same all the time. And the only thing I really mess with is the gain especially, you know, depending on how quiet the vocals or how loud the vocals were recorded. And then I also mess with the threshold a bit, uh, depending also again on how, how the vocals were recorded. Yeah. That's just the compressor I have on there. Then uh, the next thing I have on there is a fruity limiter right here. You can just see the presets right here. And uh, yeah, I don't really mess with that too much either. Then the next thing I have on there is another fruity limiter, but it uses a compressor. You can see the settings down here. And uh, yeah, sometimes I mess with the threshold a bit. Then I have a fruity de on there, as you can see right here. And yeah, it's just to uh, cut out those harsh S's and harsh P's and all that. So that's how that looks like. Then I have an empty slot right here. So you can pretty much fill what you want in there. Then the next part I have on there is uh, auto tune. I use waves tune but uh, if you use any other type of auto tune you can just delete this out and uh Put your auto tune in there and as you can see this is how it looks like right now but uh that's also something that you have to just adjust depending on the artist then the next thing we have on here is the reverb uh yeah it's fruity reverb and yeah, it has these settings right here so this is how it looks like sometimes i'll mess a bit with the size or i'll just turn up this knob down here depending how much reverb i want on that track then we have the fruity delay it's the last thing on i have on there and it's what it looks like also just some basic settings on here sometimes i mess with the volume a bit or the time depending on uh, how i want the delay to land but uh yeah other than that that's the whole preset right there so yeah after i've put all these effects down this is how the main vocals sound like smell like proud i gotta make my father proud of me working hard gotta get this check by any means living like i'm dreaming shop a steady beaming my section wearing red i'm the reason that they bleeding one figure bigger in my whip you see me speeding Cooking forces on my feet i look way more than decent yeah she said you like a bougie so that's how that's sounding like and uh, yeah for what I do for the ad libs is um, I just copy over the main vocals so I'll right click on the main vocals right here go on file save mixer track state as and I'll just pull this and uh, yeah I'll just drop it into the next slot and what that does is it just copies it over the whole thing and what I'll then do is I'll just turn up the reverb maybe add another EQ on there as you can see here right, for the ad libs what I did is I just uh, put another EQ on there where I'm cutting out a lot of the highs and lows messed a bit with the delay and uh, this is how the ad libs came out and uh, yeah that's pretty much that so that's pretty much it that's how i mix all the vocals together check out the song you know go and stream that and uh, also don't forget to download that preset in the description below you know check out my main channel all the beats and all that stuff don't forget to subscribe like and uh, yeah peace bitch i love you so much yeah it's scary love made me so blind you don't understand me yeah, feeling like I'm future right now, so baby, save me. Uh -huh.